Hey everyone, welcome back to Magnolia Budgets. Or if you're new, hello, welcome. We do all things cash stuffing, budget planning, savings challenges, and honestly, just all things dealing with money. And of course, we come here to chat. So you guys, today I am doing something different. I am stuffing my vacation binder today. So I'm super excited. It's late. I have my Hello Kitty calculator here in case I need to calculate something. And plus, it just looked so plain because I don't have it written out on my iPad. So it looks a little weird today because I don't have my iPad. But, um, we are going to be stuck in my vacation binder. Y'all have not seen it before. But first, let's count the money. I am still a little stuck, you guys. So, please bear with me. My allergies are really just acting up right now. So, we have 1, 2, 300, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, 85, 20, 40, 60, 86, 20, 40, 60, 87, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 800, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44. So we have $844 that we will be putting into our vacation binder. And so this vacation is for me and my boyfriend. We are going on a vacation. <laughs> we are going to Tennessee. So I am pretty much going to Tennessee twice this year. I'm super excited. My boyfriend has never been. So this is my second Tennessee trip. Um, so like I said, I am super excited for my boyfriend because he has never been. And I'm super excited for myself because um, this will be my first, I think, uh, well, like far out of state trip with him. So I'm super excited um it's very much needed all right so before we get started i am going to show you all my goals page i have a little sticky note back there because i keep up with um you know how much money we put in on there because i don't have a tracker all right so this is the goals page you guys it is so cute it's just like my manifestation one um but yeah so these are my goals and so pretty much gas is 500, food 500, lodging 1300, that's already paid for. Um, shopping 250, souvenirs 150, activities 300, and groceries 100. All right, so I did it in pink and green because my favorite color is pink and his is green. So you'll see a couple green things in here. So today we are going to stuff $125 in gas. So that's 120 and a five. And I chose this A7. This is the A75 binder. Um I chose this because I can use it as a wallet. Um I guess I don't have to bend it like that. I guess I could do like most people do and do it like this so let's put that on in so 125 for gas that is so stinking cute i love this size because i can put it in my purse so food is gonna get 125 and i think i used a 100 dollar bill for that so 125 for food Usually I like to do 20, uh, 20s for food, so I'm not really sure. I think I am going to do 20s. Let's do that. So 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, and then 25. Let's do that um, because that way when we go and eat, I don't know. I feel like some places do not take big bills. I don't know. I feel like I see that all the time. So, let's get it a little bit more. This is my first time having an A7. So, I'm super excited about it. Usually, um, I use my Hello Kitty binder, my A6, as like an everyday cash envelope binder. Y'all see me stuff it. I usually use that one. But I always like take the money out of it and then take the money in with me in my wallet that I have. Lodging isn't going to get anything that's paid for. My shopping is going to get $144. I think I'm going to do the $100 bill. 
So 120, 40, one, two, three, and four. So we're going to do that. I also have a $20 bill that's in my wallet that I need to bring. So pretty much my boyfriend owed me $20, you guys. Um, we had a bet that I would come back from Disney with, he, he guessed $250 and I guessed $500. And so I came back with $500. I won. So he owed me $20 to my shopping for our Tennessee trip. So I need to put that in here. He's going to be stuffing 125 and his shopping. Um, and I know that may be confusing because I think our goals were 250 So pretty much we're putting in half now. All right, so let's fold that. So his is green. So that's how I will know that this is his shopping envelope. And that way we can keep up with the money because any money that we come back with, you know, he can put it towards his savings challenges or whatever he wants to put it to. It can be for our next vacation, whatever the case may be. Souvenirs is going to get $75. So 20, 40, 60, 70, 5. And that is paid for. So I think our goal was, let's see. 150 so half of that is 75 each i didn't want to put souvenirs on there twice so our souvenirs section is paid uh fully funded so i'm super excited about that and then souvenirs he's going to do the same thing so 20 40 60 75 i am so stuffy <laughs> My boyfriend was like, I wonder why your allergies are like messing with you. He's like trying to give me medicine. And I'm like, honey, I'm fine. Like I have Benadryl, you know, and whatnot here. Like I'm okay. I have NyQuil, DayQuil. Like I'm all right. Okay. No worries. All right. So activities is going to get 75. So 20, 40, 60, 75. And we're just going to put that one in. And then we have one more category. Promise not to keep you guys too long. So let's get that on in there. Let's see how much we want it for activities. I think 300. Right. So 300 for activities. So. Oh, God. What did I do? 300 divided by 75 equals four so one fourth of that is stuffed groceries is the last one 100 dollars so 20 40 60 80 100 and i did it in 20s um because like i said i don't know i don't really like to use huge bills when i'm out and about shopping so plus most stores like the change so groceries got 100 and groceries is fully funded. We plan on eating out for the most part. Um, for our, I'm going to give you guys an up close. We plan on eating out for the most part while we are out and about. Um, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to alternate. I don't want to keep you guys too long, but I think I'm going to alternate the fold. So that way it won't be like super bulky. Probably should have did that the first go round, but like I said, this is my first time having this type of binder, so I will probably have to do bill exchanges in it since um, you know you don't want it to be super bulky, being that I'm going to be using this like as a wallet. So yeah, but I don't want to like condense it too much because, like I said, I don't really want to have like super huge bills because like I said some places don't take that so because I know at one point we were on like a coin shortage so yeah um and whatnot so right and then this is the last one I'm going to switch so 
yes i hope you guys enjoyed this video um unfortunately i don't have any of these binders um but if you are interested definitely leave a comment down below and i will definitely see what i can do yeah that's so much better I will see what I can do in getting us some A7 size binders and some envelopes and we can go ahead and get us some vacation binders made. Let me go ahead and give you guys an up close. So, gas, food, lodging, shopping, base shopping, my souvenirs, his souvenirs, I'm so excited, activities, also sorry for the shadow y'all it is nighttime i have to get some work done here at night now uh i just have to work all times of the day so groceries and then my goals page so let's get a little up close of that so yeah we have groceries fully funded souvenirs fully funded and our lodging fully funded so let's see you guys let's see how much money i need left so Gas should be in C five hundred minus one twenty five. Three seventy five. So three seventy five times two, and then lodging is paid for. Shopping, I need one oh six. He needs one twenty five, and then activities, we need two seventy five. I think plus 275 so we still need 1256 so 1256 dollars and then our vacation will be fully funded so i'm super excited about that we have a couple months so um we're gonna have to just stuff this little by little here and there 20 dollars here and there like i do five dollars here and there <laughs> um and yeah and but pretty much whatever we don't have we just won't be able to spend so whatever is in this binder is what we have to spend while we're on vacation and we're not spending anything extra and my boyfriend loves to spend y'all i am the one who handles all the finances and i have to help keep him on track with not spending and going over budget because he loves to spoil me and himself but mainly me so i am going to have to stay on him but that is it for today's video you guys don't forget to like comment subscribe to your friends all about my channel and tell them to come on over here and budget with us go check out my Etsy shop because i'm sure there's something on there that you will love and i will catch you guys in my next video all right bye